and as you're seeing here, I'm at uh, Teso College, Alloway, a very, very, very big school in Uganda. This is a whole tree. If this is the kind of fire they are using, then uh, a lot of forests are being destroyed right now. Just to cook food, we have to use this big chunk of firewood. This is a lot and this is excess. You can see it is what they are using right now. But at the end of the day, we are going to construct an energy saving volcanic rocks, solar power aided cook stove that can save up to 80%. Many logs are using previous on the previous stop. It is 50, but mm. this one now we use the 20. Using 20. I'm saving 30. You're saving 30? Yes. Okay, that is okay. Are the controllers. The controllers uh, control the air system that we're going to show you, and then they are powered by the solar system. Uh, uh, this is a charge controller. This is our battery, and there are panels mounted up. This whole system is what powers our kitchen. Okay, and our kitchen uses these natural rocks. These are volcanic rocks. There are plenty in this country, and also it uses uh, firewood. Okay, so little firewood, little firewood, as little as there is no any other kitchen that does what these rocks can do alone. That fire, that is fire in, but all smoke goes out. Nothing comes back here. So it's burning, it's cooking, but there's no smoke, you can see. Alright, so we don't only save the environment out there, but we also save the environment inside this kitchen. So whoever is using this kitchen is conveniently, you know, uh, pursuing their uh, job without smoke, 